completely back black sure you don't see anything um when the torch wasn't moved i can only see a slice of the room yep. like where the torch was projecting light yeah, he can only see where the light goes oh so my shadow vision allows me to see a little bit that's why you more. see the gray yeah okay nice awesome <laughs> oh that's awesome that's interesting uh, all right of course they hit oof i take six that's a lot Oh, that you, and you just see the crabs heard you. I was uh, like, ah, I don't mind these tiny crabs. Now they we're gonna go to the me. end of the round, and these guys have an end of the round ability. Oh my god! Man, that was a hard hit. He rolled a flat six. Oh my god, damn crab! All right, so helmet BR8 and Pecker are all targeted as the crabs swarm out and attack. We each get to make an agility roll. If we fail, we take damage and become slowed, which means we have a speed of two. Oh my Man, the god. The crabs are hit harder than the golem. <laughs> uh, golem actually was 3d6. It hits the hardest. <laughs> do I get like some sort of... Do I get a boon for this? You can... Um, actually, this round you already used your trickery to try and climb. Need so you recovery? So you don't have any boons yet. Uh, your recovery is usable as an action, not as a reaction. Okay, so no boons. Nope. So I'm going to challenge agility. Yes, success. Success. Oh, helmet failed. And oh, we're... helmet's going to die. Our healing bot's going to go. No. All right, so he takes 16 and is now slowed. Oh, for a minute. No, for one round. All right, I'm not going to put a token on I'll put a token on him. I'll do it right. Slowed. Submit for one round. All right. So that's the end of the round. Now we go to players fast. Uh, so I think and so there's a rope hanging off the edge. So anybody who wants to climb the wall and use the rope, you'll get an you'll get a boon for your roll. Yes, yeah, so I go fast using the rope, getting the All right. out of, from the crabs. So if you trickery, you'll actually have two boons if you want to, or you can do it with just one. I want to use two. I need to get the hell out of here. <laughs> All right, use two boons, and then that'll be good because I can show you some how that kind of works. Um, when you have two boons, you get the best roll. You don't get them both. You get the best one. Okay, so I get agility. So, I, wait. Okay, so I attribute agility, submit, roll modifier, boon. Two yep. boons. Two boons. Submit. All right. So and now, if you hover over your 22 and look, yeah, three it and says four. 14 plus 4. And then in parentheses, there's both dice that you rolled for your two uh -huh. boons. And it's adding the four and ignoring the three. Yep. Okay. Nice. All right. And so that's, and it does the same for Banes. If you have two Banes, you get the worst one. So I get right. like, uh, like here or something. Yeah, somewhere, yeah, that's fine. Somewhere up top is okay. So All right, I um, get out of the way just so there's room. Yep. Perfect. All right. Go ahead. Uh, go ahead, Sherm. Get your, you want to get up or do you want me to try and get up first? Um, I'm going to climb. Well, how bad off are you? I have four health left. Y you go first. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm using the... Re I, I can't. I have a speed of two right now because I'm slowed. So I can't even get to the rope. All right, I'll climb up. Yeah, climb up. Um, you guys can fish for me later or something. I don't know. Wait, <laughs> I have a... Wait, so I didn't know that. If I stay here, let's say I knew that before yeah. I take the decision of going left. Right. Um how much of the action would take for Sherm to give Helmut the rope and I yank him? Can I do that? Um, yeah, um, Helmut could use his action. Could do basically just he could just do it without using his action. He could hand uh, Helmut the rope. Helmut can use his action to tie it to himself, and then you can use your action to pull Helmut up. Okay, that's let's do that. Yeah, that would All right. work. All right, so go ahead and do that, and that will require you just to make a strength roll uh, just to get my fat dwarven butt up the hill. Come on. Yes! <laughs> Barely. Up. Oh, we see. That is, that is going to let the crab swing at me on the way up, though, because I did leave their area. So the crabs will try and 
bite me on the way out. And they hit for four, which will drop oh, me to unconscious. Dead. Uh, oh my god. They pinch him in the toe like bling. <laughs> All right. Now we need uh, Sherm to try and get up the wall. Okay. And you said two boons? Uh, yes. Um, you don't have trickery, so you'll just have one boon for using okay. the rope. Okay. All right. So you're up top. I just, hope the, the, I just hope the torch was yanked along Helmut. That is weird. <laughs> it's seldom, it's, it's a magic torch. It follows Helmut wherever he goes. Uh, the problem is I think when Helmut knocked unconscious on his way up, his torch fell down into the water. And, oh no! Uh, and I have a, a lantern. Alright, does someone has a lantern? I do. Alright, we'll and just keep it. And and oil and everything. Yeah, and All I right. got a couple torches also. All right, so we'll just leave the torch out, and somebody else will keep it near them instead. So right now, what's happening with Helmut? All right, so somebody has a healing now. potion. Uh, I do. All right, so I have to make one roll before you get a chance to do that. I have to roll a d6. Yeah, faith roll. And what I forgot to do is I want to do is I want to make a death roll chart. Let me just make a note to make it for later on, so I have it. Death roll what chart. is a faith roll? You roll D6 right. on one, you die on six, you become disabled. So six, I am, I heal one point. Oh, right, Correct? because that was, yeah, you are disabled. Because I wasn't dying yet. Basically, oh, I became right, yeah. incapacitated. And so then I shook it off. I rolled it at the end of the round, and I kind of woke up a little bit. And I am here with 19 damage on me. Yeah, I, I, I say you give him your potion, BR. Okay. All right. I take it happily, drink, and heal five more. All right. Damn it. We had to waste all those resources just for a crab bite. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm slow, guys. No, nah, don't worry about it. Okay, so I'm the one carrying the torch now. I got torch duty. I can, I can pick it back No, nah, don't worry. Right. I'll, do, I'll do it. Okay. All right, so then we're moving along again. And I still, okay. I think I have one more heal spell still. I do yes. have one more, but I want to save it for combat. And I'm just going to stay in the back a little more. All right. So I stretch the torch here just so I can see more. All right. Obviously, I am scanning for more dangerous traps and whatnot. Looks like a plain corridor, guys. Looks actually just, just very similar to the corridor that you came down. It's carved out of stone and has the geometric corner post <laughs> uh, carved in. Okay. Packer, do you want to look for traps or something unusual? Yes, definitely. Try to carefully step forwards. Do I see you know, doors at the end of the tunnel, uh, corridor? After, after all the searching you've done and all of the, um, and the trap that you did find earlier, you're pretty sure this hallway looks as empty or as normal as possible. Okay, looks clear for now. Okay, I take point again. Torch follows. Ooh, somebody's in the dark. <laughs> B-Raid's back there going, come on, quit moving so fast. Guys. <laughs> Get in here. All right. Um, and your door looks the same as they have so far. It's another wooden door, swollen outwise, but looks fairly loose in its hinges. Okay. Yeah, I'm not confident enough to just go up there and, and open it. So go do your rogues. Go do your rogue stuff, Packer. Come on. Don't take too long. All right, you poet. Master. All right, door opens easily, and inside you see two thrones. Mm -hmm. oh, Sitting in fuck. each throne, there is a skeleton. I <laughs> go. Fuck no, fuck no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, for your fast phase, you move backwards. Anybody else wish to go? Nope. And, and I are. just say trouble, huh? Now when Becker comes running back. By the way, here's your skeletons, just because I made the token, I might as well show it. Uh, there you go. This, these ones those. have weapons and shields? Uh, these do have a shield and a sword, and they look like they are more well-constructed than the previous batch. Nice. Prepare for combat. Okay, so I take point. 
and I say we use the photo. Do they respond to the door opening? They're yeah, dormant they both, in their they throne? Both stood up. They just stood up, which is like a, a non-action. They were sitting relaxed. So and if we say, reason, will they attack or would they wait for us to move on them? Uh, it's hard to say. They, they, they do not look happy to see you. But they I'm haven't gonna, acted yet. I say funnel tactics. Yeah. All right. Uh, so you're going to move there. You're going to move there. Helmet's going to stay and wait for slow. So on slow, they do move up to you. Moves to there. Moves to there. And both take a swing at old Orky boy. I hope you're not lucky. And if they do hit me, not hard. Okay, one is tired. Yes! Ha! Uh, All right. So I'm like, ping, ping! Bring it <laughs> on, skeletons. All right. <laughs> All right, uh, that should be Helmet. He's still going to hang back here. He's going to move up here in case he has to heal you. No, but no, he no, is no, trying. no, 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 not, not here. I was wondering, because, uh, what? And that way you can shoot through this one? Yeah, you're good. Yeah. That's, that's good, no vein? Yeah, you'll be fine, yeah. Yeah, so I was thinking yeah, I mean, about... I, obviously, I'm not being ultra picky because it's a hand-drawn map on uh -huh. top of a grid. So pretty close, you're okay. Um, so go ahead if you want to go there, Pecker, if you want to go slow. Oh, actually, it's fast, fast of the second round, I'm sorry. I have buttons that I can click, but they aren't working because the photos uh, aren't on this computer, I guess. BR8 Sharon did his action. I'm going to go in the slow turn. All right. So. I'm definitely going to smash on fast. All right. So go ahead on uh, fast and smash. Okay. I will also go fast, but after. Do, go, go ahead. Go ahead, Matt. Smash. Shoot first. I mean, I can. Maybe I will only. Let's see if I can target the left one, or do I need to target? Hey, yeah, you're gonna have to target this one because they're the same problem my other skeletons yeah. had. Okay, but I'm attacking the left one. Yeah. Target this one, and I'll just put the damage on the other one. I'm using trickery, of course, because I want to hit that bastard hard. God damn it! This. Oh, that <laughs> damage. <laughs> Yeah, that damage sucks, <laughs> but okay. Not the same. What the? Better than nothing. Hold on, that one doesn't have the right health. Oh, he died. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure he, he didn't kill him. Yeah, it you doesn't... hit him in the sweet spot. It dismantled. <laughs> now, I told you my skeletons got all jacked up somewhere. I don't know what I did to them, so we'll just do that. This one, these ones look more bonus. So I guess they have slightly more hit points, too. Yeah, yeah. they're a little stronger, a little tougher. All right, go ahead with the mall there, Mongrel. Where's the bar? Just want to see how much XP he lost, or actually, damage points. Okay, let's bring it on. I have to target the guy that's right in front of me, right? Okay, yeah. Boom. One. Come on. Yep. Ten damage. Why are you attacking the one that... Uh, I attacked the one you? that he attacked as well. All right, so it dies, and I'll clear the damage off of this one. All right, so we're good. One skeleton explodes, <clears throat> and gory, bloody skeleton <laughs> goose sprays everywhere. Um, all right, fast. It's the paint material uh, they use to do the wall drawings. That's why yeah. they have blood. Helmet's going to pass. The skeleton's going to go fast. And he will attempt to hit you with his fist for no damage. And that leaves a slow phase for Berate. Hmm. Are these guys pretty tough? You've fought a bunch of them. They don't seem to be that tough, right? No, they're not that strong. All right, I'm going to move to here, and I'm going to strike it with my club. All right, do it. Oh. No boons, no banes, just hit it in the face. Club yeah, I, I, I can't select the target, so... Is he not selectable? That should be the one that is selectable. Yeah, I had the same problem with the last one. What is going on with your token? Grr. Right, I mean, you... when I say select, I mean I'm trying to select the skeleton, right? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, let me look and do something real quick and see what's going on. Maybe I've just got you tagged weird on control. Edit. No, it says it's got... Sherm is the only one controlling it. Sherm. I'll put my name back on it also just to see. Mm -hmm. That is weird. All right, so BR8, we're going to hit club. It says target. I click the skeleton. Roll modifier, none. Nice. Yeah. I don't know why you can't do it. <laughs> oh, got it. It's my bad. There we go. It's okay, go ahead, and do, go ahead and do your roll. Okay. Not nice. <laughs> Indeed, you suck at rolling dice. Good job. I, do. I do. <laughs> All right. Um, so that was the slow. Nothing happens at the end of the round because we have nothing weird going on. So we're going to go to fast, uh, fast players. Mongrel, you want to hit it in the face with them all? Yes, and now Packer has a Bane, right, no matter what, because both of us are in front of I him. I mean, I have normal, I guess, because I have Trickery, Aza, Boom, and Bane from Houston in the way, so I just roll without any bonuses. Just normal roll, I, I get. So you try to hit him first. Six damage. All right. And Man, 4 one, one. You have rolled a lot of ones on your mall, I can tell you that. Yes. <laughs> You're due for an 18 damage before too long. All right. Um, great. Do you want to hit it so we don't waste an arrow if you happen to kill it? Sure, let's give it a shot. All right. Saving it for the big bad guy. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> All and right. there's a reason why I learned to cast magic. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, helmet uh, uh, doesn't have anything no, I that is helpful. To go with shooting. Mm. I have oh. a spell that can attack, but not from far away. So Question. I... Is there still a play? No, wait. My freaking dagger does 1d3 damage, so it's... Yeah, you might as well just shoot it with an arrow and try yeah, to... Yeah, I'm, just, I'm shooting with the arrows because otherwise it's... Freaking impossible for me to kill anything. Yep. <laughs> uh, non using tickable no submit. Ah, Jesus. All right. This it house. has two targets, so I'm gonna roll a d6 and say odd attacks mongrel and even will attack the clockwork. Even will attack the clockwork. Is that what I said? <laughs> yes. Yeah, right. probably. Uh, oh, a one! Thankfully, <laughs> RDM also has not the greatest rolls, not all the times. Yeah, this is... <laughs> That's fine. Cool. Go ahead, Sherm. All right, so that's the end of that round. Again, nothing crazy going on at the end of the round. We go back to fast actions for players. Yeah, frontliners try to finish them all without me okay. using more arrows. Do you want to try to hit it with the club for yeah. payback? Try <laughs> payback for nothing? Uh, <laughs> for trying. Oh, hey. There you go. Hey, that takes him. He's gone. Six puts us to 12. Okay. Big splatter of skeleton blood. And he dies. So, standard. Look for arrows. All right. Okay, let's play Explore the Room. You want me to add those arrows back for you, Pecker? I think, that, I think the ammo script has a, something with GM has to do it or something. I might not have flagged it right. It's a long script. All right, so we move in here, and you guys notice that there's a huge ball of cobwebs up in the northwest corner. Um, and as you come into the room, crawling up and out of those cobwebs is oh, a spider wow. in large proportions. Oh, we did one bad thing, guys. We assumed, there were, I... no, we assumed there were no more enemies in that fucking room. <laughs> <laughs> and so it's coming right over here and going to take a bite out of Pecker. So if I throw my lantern in there, would it catch fire? Um, if Yeah, I would think so. The, but it might smoke out the whole room, too. So 
true. Oh, really kill the damn spiders. Uh, spiders. That's the... <laughs> spiders get a boon on their attack. Oh. Bye bye. Pa it's gonna be Packer's oh, first misses. scratch. No, it may man, and he has high death. Alright. Yeah. I'm as a motherfucker. Alright, I rolled a five. Okay. Man, what is that for? The boom? Man, the boom rolled high. Nice. Yeah. All right, so it is. Uh, that was surprise. So fast phases players. I'm gonna go. In How many back. spiders are we talking about? I go fast phase and I retreat. All right, so you can move half your speed away. That's plenty. You're good. All right. Um, okay. Anybody else I'm fast? gonna. Can I move here and hit it? You can. It's considered a charge, so you'd have one bane, which will cancel out your normal boon that you always get as a warrior, so you just have a normal roll. Ooh. Because I don't want to get in the way, so the I mean, can shoot it. You know, you I, if, if you it won't matter. I, I, I can just retreat in that direction or something. Can yeah, I hit sure. it from here? Yeah. You can't hit it from there, no. If I move here, is a charge as well or not? If I move and hit, it's a charge. That's it. In the fast phase, if you wait until slow, then you don't have to worry about that. That's nah, the gamble between it. fast and slow. I'm going for it. Screw it. Right. I'm moving here and I'm hitting it. Do it. Hit it in the face. Okay, so if you move like that, whatever. Take that. All right. What the hell? Why does it have a zero defense? Yeah, I just like, what? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's, uh, I swear that I went and did all of these bad guys, and like a th half of them are working. It is Does amazing. he have more than? He doesn't have twenty. Defense, no, no, no. But it? I still want to. I gotta look at it for whatever reason. It got changed to zero. It's not zero. All right. Fixed. Uh, close. That's one less thing I have to do later. So. All right. So it still does the twenty still hits him. So don't worry about that. And you do seven. So he takes seven, and that spider is unhappy. Uh, All right. Does he look like injured, badly injured, or just scratched? Um, he have... does not look. He's not halfway yet. Oh. He's about a quarter or so of looking at the red bar. I can't see its red bar. Yeah. Is it? Is it hidden? I might have hit him. Yeah. I was. I'm toying with hiding some of them. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah, okay. This uh, guy, um, the, the previous skeletons as well. It's it's okay. Okay, so I did my action, Mongrel did his, so what's Hermut and the BR-8? Uh, I'm just going to go up there and... Go ahead, BR-8, what are you going to do, boss? I'm going to fire a spell. I right, do it. Did that fire? Oh, yeah, hang on. All right, try your spell book and see if that one works again. All right, because you're using unearing darts, one target, one damage. It should All be right, let me... Yeah, let me show you. Let me. There should be a. There's a better way to do that spell. Let me explain it real quick. It's one of those uh -huh. complex ones. So when you hit um, unearing darts, which you won't be able to because you just use the casting. Right. It asks you for your first target. Right. Then a second and a third. Right. The reason is, is the API makes you choose all the targets that you possibly could have. Okay. Um, so you just pick the one, and then you give all of the damage to it, zero to the second and third, and okay. then. It out right okay if that makes sense makes perfect sense all right and so if watch i'm going to cheat and give you back your castings real quick okay all right so you just rested and got all your castings back and that way it's just easy enough to go ahead and redo the spell and see if it works correctly this time And I meant to tell you that one, but then since we messed it up, I wasn't sure it was going to work, but it looks like it will work if we get all the clicking. It's just a lot of clicking. There we go. Yay. That's right, much so, better. So three magic missile basically looking things blast out of B-Rate's fingers and crash into the spider, doing seven damage. And it bloodies, or it is injured now. Nice. Oh, yeah. Seeing it injured, helmet's going to move on over to here. By the way, if you notice, as long as you stay adjacent to the bad guy, it doesn't trigger that free attack. It's only when you move out of its reach. Yeah. yeah. So uh, I'm going to move all the way around here to stay out of Pecker's way. Okay, I'm not saying anything to Helmut. If he wants to get close, then it's his choice. Helmut's oh, got a plan. 
that it failed. All right, I failed on my attack. Okay. So does that leave... Well, that's the end of... That's fast, right? So now the spider gets to go. Mongrel, you hit it, so it's going to bite you back. That's okay. Oh, by one. Nice. Man, I might not get to poison anybody. All right. Oh, yay. Um, Fuck, poison. All right, top of the round. Uh, anybody, uh, it's fast phase. Go with it if you got it. Yeah, I, I'm shooting the fucker. Shoot it right in the face. Yeah, definitely with the boon. With a uh, trickery boon. Please make him. Yes, I hit the bastard. Six damage. Six, I think, takes it out. We'll see. Yep. Yes. Sweet. And the spider is dead. Nice. I just make like a headshot and nail the spider on its head. That's what you get, bitch, for trying to bite me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to poke the cobweb just to make sure there's nothing there. Maybe a hidden chest or whatever or another yeah. spider or something. There is nothing else exciting there. Okay. Am I correct to assume that there is a door here? There is a door right there, yes. It's right here is a door. And it looks just like all the other ones we've had. Rogue is stuff. Yeah, Anything special good. about the thrones? Yeah. No, the th uh, there appear to be. Um, they're actually carved out of uh, a solid piece of wood. Mm -hmm. uh, probably had to be carved in the room. They've got ornate runes, but they're oh. all um, awesome. all dark magic, uh, you know, necromancy, and uh, demonology kind of ruins covering the whole things. Okay. No secret little doors hiding in them or anything fun like that. Yeah, of course. After the fight with the spider, I recover arrows. All right, I'll get you two added to you here in a second when I get back off of the lighting map. Okay. All right, so pop check the door. It's clean like the last few. And and we'll open. I check it and then I open it. All right. 